We're on the road. Where transportation goes, community grows. Welcome to On the Road with the MTA. And welcome to another edition of On the Road with the MTA. I'm Jay Gibbons alongside with Stephanie Kay from the MTA. How's Stephanie today? I am well, Jay. Thanks for asking. I love this time of the year because people are so kind to each other and they're so generous. Wouldn't it be nice if everybody was kind and generous all year round? Yes, wouldn't it though? Absolutely. I heard some some most heartwarming stories, especially on our podcast. Yes. When people are delivering free meals and they're helping out. We just did... delivered some free meals with the Salvation Army. We were serving food to anybody that came in. That was so rewarding. Love doing that. That's fantastic. It always makes you feel real good that you're doing something to help. I know. And the need is so great out yep. there. And that's why I'm so glad to be able to introduce you to somebody that we're talking with today. His name is Charles Winfrey, and he's doing something very special for some seniors around town. And I love that. He's also a board member here at MTA. Now, Charles, what else do you do? What is your profession? Where else do you work? Well, in addition to being a uh a uh, member of the Genesee County Board of Commissioners. I'm also the executive director of um, the Floyd J. McCree Theater. Which is a great theater. As a matter of fact, I, I know some people, that the family that owns that, and they are just the best ever, and they do such great work there. So how long have you worked with them? Oh, uh, well, uh, I've been off and on for, wow, uh, okay. initially 10 years and, and now for the last 20 years. Oh, my gosh. For about 30 years altogether. Do you wow. know Do you know Brian McGree? He's a comedian. He's very funny. Sure, sure. I know Brian. Yeah, he's awesome. We had him on the radio station many a times because he's just wonderful. He does a lot of fundraisers out there, too. But I think his father's very involved with the theater. So great family. And so tell us what they're doing on the dates that you're going to ask MTA to give the seniors rides to this great play. Well, we have a partnership between uh, MTA, uh, the Valley Area Agency on Aging, and McCree Theater to... Um, uh, to get uh, a number of seniors uh, on a theater outing uh, free of charge. Uh, MTA, of course, is providing the transportation. Uh, VAAA is picking up the admission. And the theater is responsible for recruiting the uh, seniors to take part in it. Oh, that is wonderful. The show is called Christmas at Crossroads. And I looked on your website, and it's very interesting. It's been a six-year hiatus. They just brought this back. Really? And it's talking about the yes. interest, yeah, the impact behind the coming of Christ and how the holiday has transformed this into a commercial enterprise <laughs> that it's become instead of what it's really meant to be. So that sounds like a very interesting show. Uh, it is, and it's going to be a very uh, spectacular show. Uh, full of every kind of music imaginable uh, that has to do with the holiday season, including uh, some jazz, some gospel, uh, some R&B, uh, and some uh, Christmas pop. And it's only $10 admission? It's only $10, uh, but this uh, particular uh, project with the seniors, uh, the seniors are admitted free. Yes, and they get to go on December 9th and the 16th. They're going from the Slidell right. Senior Center. I love that. Now, the right. show itself takes place from December 8th until the 23rd. I was an actress before I got into radio, and I know how expensive it can be to put a show on. So I don't know how you can afford to do this for just $10, but I'm so grateful you can. Well, well thanks to the citizens of Genesee County, uh, we're recipients of uh, Arts and Cultural Enrichment Millage uh, that sort of puts the bill for uh, that, that allows us to, to offer such a cheap uh, admission rate uh, because, you know, they are paying uh, in part with their tax dollars. So can all seniors come to the Slidell Senior Center and on that day on December 9th and the 16th to get a free uh, ride? Well, they certainly can. Wonderful. Uh, I think they have plenty of parking there. So if they want to come there and, and, and hop on the bus, uh, they can be our guests. Aww. I love that. So is there a website or a phone number they can get a hold of you so they can make that happen? Right. The website is thenewmccreetheater.com, and the telephone number is 810-787-2200. Perfect. Oh, Charles, it's so wonderful you're doing this. Doesn't it just feel so good to be able to help people like this? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, and it keeps me young. (laughs) Oh, that's important. (laughs) Well, you sound like a little bit of Santa Claus yourself, and so I can't wait to meet you in person and hopefully see this show because, like I said, I was an actress, so I love good theater, and we're so lucky to have the New McGree Theater, and that's located at 4601 Clio Road in Flint. So, All right. Well, thank you. Thank you for this opportunity. Absolutely. And like I was telling Jay, you will just be amazed with what people do in this community to help each other out. And we do this every week. It's called On the Road 
with the, the MTA team. and Jay and Stephanie K. Yep. Now, if you'd be like Charles and like to be a guest on our radio Just podcast. send us an email at podcast at mtaflint.org. That's it. There you go. And thanks for listening. Charles, thanks for all you do, and thanks for listening. You've been listening to On the Road with the MTA. For more information on our services and community outreach, visit us online anytime at www.mtaflint.org. And be sure to follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube. The MTA, your community, your connection, your way.